and then you're gonna see this create a computer account so just putting any name that you like create a password that makes sense to you you can put a hint for it and then just click on continue on by the way you can continue without putting the hint that's just optional so right now it's just gonna take a little bit just to create that account and then we're gonna be almost done it's gonna ask us to set up siri it's gonna ask us to set up fingerprint as well um which you could skip a lot of that stuff if you don't want to location services i highly suggest having that on just so google maps works better and everything works better really uh share your data you don't need to share anything that you don't want i suggest sharing it with apple just so they can make this better but you don't have to screen time this is more if this is for your kids or something like that i don't use it myself really uh whenever i use my mac it's just for work or for anything like that so i don't really care how much time i spend on the screen uh if you guys do want to take a look at all that stuff you guys can set up but in this case, I'm going to set up later. Uh, Siri. Siri is awesome to set up. So right now, uh, we can enable Siri. Now I'm going to show you how to set up Siri right this second. So all we have to do is press on continue on the bottom right hand side. Choose your voice. I think number four is the number one. Hi, I'm Siri. Choose the voice you'd like me to yeah. use. You guys can choose any other voice that you would like. Settings. Press continue. And here we go. We're just going to read what it tells us here. And that's it. It's going to recognize our voice from then. So let's just go into continue on. Siri, how's the weather? Hey Siri, send a message. Siri, set a timer for three minutes. Hey Siri, get directions home. Siri, play some music. And there we go, Siri's ready. So that's all we have to do. Just read whatever he told us to read. Going to continue. You can share your audio recordings or not. I'm gonna share them. You don't have to. I know a lot of people don't like to do that, so don't do it if you don't want to. Touch at the So like I mentioned before, up here on the top right hand side, that's your power button and touch ID. So that's your fingerprint, and it's extremely easy to set up. So we're going to go into continue. All we have to do is just tap away here. So choose any finger that you like, really. But we're just going to tap there and keep pointing up, down, up, down, up, down. Again, we're tapping. We're not really pressing down. And we're going to do that for a second time. We're just placing our finger on top, going to continue, and done. So right here, you can choose whether... You want a dark look to this, so let me just show you. That's the dark look or the light mode, or both. So during the day, it's gonna look like this, and then at nighttime, it's gonna turn dark, so it's easier on your eyes. In terms for this video, it's just better if I choose that, so you guys can see better. But I definitely like the dark mode, just personally. Going to continue, and we are done our setup. So the basic stuff that you guys get on your Mac would be these apps down here below. You can see them all. So those are the basic apps. So let me just show you a little bit better. So again, all these are basic apps that you always get with your Mac. You can download any other ones. And here they are. So here are all the basics. Let me just show you in here. You have more apps. And that's it. That's all your Macs that you guys get. Uh, let me just show you which one does what. So GarageBand, that's to edit audio music. You guys can create music there. Um, iMovie, edit videos. Then we have stuff like Pages, which is like Microsoft Word, Numbers, which is like Excel. We've got, what else do we have here that you guys might use right away? Would be books, well, books, not really, not that many people would use that. Although I like it, that's where you guys can download some books. There's a lot of free ones as well. Apple TV, that's a hub. So you guys could go into there for Netflix or anything really, or Apple TV Plus, there's channels in there. So it's just a hub for a lot of channels you guys can get. And there's one that I don't see for some reason, but it's down here below, it's Keynote, and that's like PowerPoint. So that's down here below. Anyways, I'm just gonna click away. And to get to that thing where it's gonna show me all the apps that I have, I just I can just click here, like so. All right, and what else should you guys know? That's it, I mean, you guys can start playing with your Mac right now. I do have a manual that teaches you how to Go about your Mac and setting things up and using your Mac. However, this is just a setup video. You guys are all set up. And that would be it for this video. If you guys have any questions, comments, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Thank you.